it's definitely an impressive work-life balance going for you there. Um, and I know a lot of people strive to get that, to try and to try and get to what they want to do and achieve their dreams like, like the way that you have. Do you have any advice to people trying to do that? Any just general steps that they can take to, to get to, to get to like a level of success like yourself? Yeah, I mean, I'd say planning for me has always been key. Like, Jason mm-hmm. and I are carnage, but we're, like, organised carnage. Organised carnage, yeah, yeah. Yeah, like, you know, okay, some things will be a bit last minute. And, like, our mums both know that we are a bit last minute. I mean, I literally have to message my mum this morning to be like, can you pick Albie up at school? Because <laughs> Jason can't, and obviously I'm not there. And then, Coming on the podcast. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you're just like, uh, okay. But they know that. But I just think there was lots of times where we would both write down what training we were doing and then we could work out who was going to be there when. Mm-hmm. And it just kind of worked. But I do think, yeah, you have to plan and be quite organised. Um, but I would also say never get put off like by anything. Lots of people said to me, like talking purely about like a work-life balance, because lots of people said to me, don't get dogs. Well, we got dogs. And right. that didn't affect training. You know what I mean? Like, I mean we went on to winning Rio. So yeah. It wasn't like it had a massive effect. And then having a baby at the time seemed insane. Like there hadn't been many people that had done it. It certainly hadn't been anyone that had done it successfully, like yeah. not to the level obviously that I was striving for. And so I just think don't be put off by what other people think because yeah. ultimately there's got to be a first. You know what I mean? There's got to yeah. be a first for things. And I think now that there proves that there's been enough people that, I mean, not, saying like to have it all i hate that saying because loads of people say that to me oh you've got it all and it's mm-hmm. like you literally don't see me at home like you don't know what it's like at yeah, home. Yeah, <laughs> like yeah. it may look like it's all but it's hard <laughs> but it's also not forgetting that that okay if you are gonna you know try and get this perfect balance it can be a juggle and it can be hard at times but honestly it's totally worth it 